Hello my YouTube friends, this is Karim from Merak on Top Fragrances. In this video, I will show you what to wear depends on your mood. person that I have a fragrance for everything, for any occasion, for the weather, and for my mood, of course. So, less fragrances I use when I feel happy. Well, Asaru Wanted. This one is the first one. It's a really happy fragrance, you can say. You have a really cool vibe and just awesome for those happy days. Another fragrance that I use is Aura by Arma. This fragrance, for sure, it have a really happy vibe. Every single time I use it, it's because I'm really excited, really happy, and it's like long-lasting fragrance too. The same with the Wanted, long-lasting. And I use also Citizen Jack, Absolute. This fragrance, you have a, a bubble gum kind of type of scent that is for those happy days for sure and when you try to feel elegant at the same time. So this is what I use and those are my top three happy fragrance. How about when I'm mad or I have a strong feeling like probably depression or when I'm actually like bothered by something or when I'm even sad. So for, I can say for strong emotions, this is what I use. I use Drucker Noor because it's really powerful fragrance. It don't last the whole day. And this one specifically I use when I'm really extremely bothered by something or someone. And that's why I picked this fragrance for all those strong emotions that I have, especially when I'm mad or I have to demand something or command something, I use Drucker Noir, okay? Another fragrance that I use, that it's from Dakar 2, and it's actually new release from the 2022, is Drucker Intense. But this one is mostly for those mellow days, those like kind of melancholic mood. That's what I call this one. Mostly melancholic mood and a little bit mad sometimes, but not too much as when I use this is because I'm really upset. Okay, another fragrance that I use uh, for those strong feelings is Explore by Ryan Tradition. It's actually a really nice fragrance for sure. It have a strong character. So this is what I like to use when I'm like mad, when I'm, uh, I have a strong feeling. Okay, this is the one, two, and the last one, but not the least one, is the Just Cavalli. This one, I use it when I have a strong feeling as well, like if I'm mad, sad, or I had to command something. So this is the four fragrances I mostly use, and they're awesome, long lasting, and actually project a lot, that's why if I have to talk with somebody, I mean, they can sense me already, especially because my fragrance is really strong too, and it's invade their personal space. So yeah, I'm coming strong with everything, including my use fragrance. When I'm in the flirt mode, yeah. With the girls, you know, I want to be like a little bit flirt and a little bit cool around them, or even when I go to the club and I want to be nice and cool around girls, what I use, well, the first one I pick is Dolce Gabbana The One. I usually wear this one in different types of occasions and different type of my mood because it's really sexy, attractive fragrance for sure. Girls love it and it's so masculine and sex appealing to be honest. So this one is perfect for flirt specifically. It does attract a lot of women for sure. And on top of that, it projects a lot. Second one for my flirt mode. Well, I can recommend you Territory Noir. This fragrance is a great fragrance too. It's awesome, it's really masculine. It's a little bit sweet. Well, it's actually sweet, but it's a masculine sweet that the girls love. For sure, they want to go around you when you get this fragrance for sure. If you haven't get your girl, go grab this fragrance and believe me, 
your girl will never forget you for sure this one is awesome fragrance for sure and it's loud it projects a lot and it's long lasting for sure territory noir and the third one that i use on that mood is well probably you guess it if you see my other videos tom ford nor extreme this is an awesome fragrance too it's sweet projects a lot it's a little bit more mature than the other two for sure it's woody so that gives a little bit more matureness to this but it's sex appealing as well which is a great fragrance to be around woman and of course woman love this fragrance for sure and hey you smell like a dessert for them you know with this fragrance so of course they go around you <laughs> so those are my three fragrances for flip what are used for my chill mood <laughs> that's interesting mood to be honest with you but i usually use crumb united by asaru it's a great fragrance really relaxing chill fresh clean fragrance which is perfect for those moods to be honest the second one that I use is the Chrome Legend Asaro 2. Yeah, this one is a really chill mood too. It's a little bit more sweet, but it's aquatic and give you that freshness that you need for those cool days that you were just feeling like to relax, to be chill, to be nice, you know, and just, uh, just really fresh, relaxing. Well, another fragrance that I use when I want to be chill, you know, but this one I want to project a little bit more. Well, I use and another Asaro for sure is the Asaro Most Wanted Perfume 2022 release. Yeah, brand new. But this one is chill too, really cool. This one especially for when I want to project a little bit. It's so chill, fresh, but it have a hint of sweetness which you make it like really cool fragrance and when you put it on you feel cool you feel relaxed too but you can project with this fragrance more than the other two fragrance the other one is just to be like more light more relaxed and this one is uh, for project a little bit more but at the same time you can say i'm chill you know it's really cool this one too and well for this uh, mood i do actually have a couple more like Burberry Tosh this one I really love it for those chill moods for sure it's really cool because it's not too loud but you smell yourself the whole day which is great great fragrance for sure too another one that I can use for those chill moods is the Drucker Essence it's a really nice fragrance too aquatic fragrance really relax in those cool moods for sure Awesome. What I use when I'm in a beach mood. Yeah, you hear it right. I get those moods in which I want to travel to the beach or the lake. But here in Las Vegas, we don't have a beach. So I cannot go and travel, you know. So I have to transport myself with a fragrance to those places. So what I usually wear? Well, Oasis from Bath & Body. This is a great fragrance, really tropical, nice coconut type of fragrance, which is great for those type of beachy moods. If you cannot travel, but or if you can travel, why not? The fragrance that I use for those beachy moods is Tropa Delique by Rue 21. Cheap fragrance actually, but it smells really good. It's really tropical. Coconut fragrance, fresh too, all in once and masculine at the same time, which is great. It's just discontinued, or at least that's what they say when they saw me this, but it's worth the price, you know. It's good. Another fragrance that I use is Salvatore Fergamo Free Time. Just because it's truly really citrusy fragrance, it's really nice. It reminds me of the beach for sure have that beachy vibe like really citrusy tropical type of fragrance really smooth so yeah to check it out this one for those beachy days Salvatore Fergamo free time 
another fragrance that is good and I'll tell you why it's good too is the Cuba Coal I bought this one like a long time ago actually and it's a coconut fragrance you have the that vibe of the Lemel that's actually why I buy it that's why I bought this one to be honest because they say that it smells like the mel, the mel by John Paul Gutio. So I want to see that it's true. And actually, it's totally true. You have a really good longevity, to be honest, at least on my skin. And it smells exactly the same because I do have one for comparable and they smell the same, to be honest. So yeah, and this one is a better price. It's a coconut fragrance, like a sunscreen too. Fragrance at the at the very end. The only thing that I don't like about Lemel and uh, Cuba Gold is that they have a after smell. But I mean, for a hot day, like beachy type of vibe, it's pretty. Cool. But I'm in the mood that I'm okay with pretty much everything, and I don't know what's up with me that day. You know, I just neutral. I don't have you know like big ass emotions like happy super happy or too sad depressed when i'm just like playing kind of type of mood what i use well let me show you i usually use uh dylan blue versace because it doesn't project that much it's okay fragrance you know it's not good but it's just okay nothing impressive on it and plus the projection is not good so i can use this one just to be you know like that type of neutral kind of type of fragrance just fresh cool uh, a little bit on the you know like okay side so this one is perfect for that i can use it in any t-shirts which is great because it doesn't have a specific location to be honest so i use this just when i feel just because that's why I use this fragrance, really versatile fragrance and well, it's great for that, for those okay cool days another one that I use is another Versace is the Dreamer because it's a nice fragrance for sure I like actually this one better than this one because this one is long lasting and projects a little bit more than this one it doesn't project like to a huge size distance but it's perfect the projection is fair on this one and it's long lasting definitely this one is way long lasting than this one and you can use it also in any occasion it's a really fresh fragrance a little bit of sweetness on the back as you see i like mostly like sweet kind of type of fragrance i didn't think i liked before that much sweetness on the fragrance but i mean it's a specific sweetness for this type of my mood this type of occasion which is great and this one is cool for those just okay days you know very versatile honestly this one you can put it for any occasion especially on a hot day it's great so i use that one for the okay another one is the most wanted by asaro this one i love it more than the other two for sure it's great long lasting it projects which i do love it's just more sweet to be honest so if i feel just okay but a little bit more leaning like to be nice you know not mean like for the tracker nor what i mean or mad i use that one but this one is for me to be more like nice more like you know just a standard kind of type of mood nothing too crazy you know nothing too exciting nothing too happy too too happy but this one is just great for project that i'm cool you know that i'm cool pretty much with everything that day i just have a plain mood you know just a little bit sweet you know this one is the one what that i use when i'm in that elegant mood kind of type well i use toshi gabbana the one because it's really elegant this fragrance i do love this fragrance so much it's awesome if you want to be elegant this is the this is the one to be honest this is the 
great fragrance for be elegant for sure any occasion even for clubbing this one is great but for be in a suit really presentable this one is great too for a go to the wedding you know it's just that elegant mood that sometimes i wake up and i like to dress up i feel just you know that type of mood you know that i look elegant that i feel elegant so that's what i use another one that i use when i have that elegant mood is another Asaro. Asaro wanted one night. part of this fragrance, it make it like a little bit spicy and it's a little bit sweet and it have a mixture of fruits which make it so elegant fragrance, really smooth fragrance for sure. This one is awesome just to be really presentable, to go to church, really nice. Oh, like my moods you know because i do have those days that i like to you know just wear like a tie you know or wear a bottom down shirt you know look presentable look really nice really elegant so this one it projects that elegance for sure really cool and by now you're thinking damn you have a lot of asaros yeah that's my favorite brand so far the asaro most of the fragrances of this company i do love it for sure another fragrance that i can say it's really elegant at least for me and this one it was one of my first love for sure it was the sweat but by bath and body works it's citrusy fragrance really smooth that projects that elegance that you need it just that is uh, different than the one and the sorrow wanted by night because those two are sweet but this one is not sweet at all it's more fresh and well it's a uh, it has sandalwood on that it's a really nice fragrance for sure really smooth really elegant another fragrance that i use the from bath and body work actually it is the graphite it's an elegant fragrance too it's a little bit sweet but not too much this one is in the middle of the sweetness in the freshness so but it's smooth as well which is great and also project a lot so my friends this is uh, all my mood collection <laughs> the friends that i usually use in those type of mood so if you want me to bring more fragrances depends on different moods because you never know i do have beachy moods i do have sad happy you know those are more but chill out moods or you know clubbing moods when I'm not clubbing which is a little bit strange but I do have those kind of strange moods I'm a unique person and I'm just cool so that's why I do have those type of moods when I really don't go to those places that's why I use my fragrances to transport me okay to those kind of scenarios which is great okay so but if you have a strange mood that I didn't mention over here and you want to hear about a fragrance that I can put on that mood just let me know in the comments below I will appreciate it so much that you watch this video and you share it too and if you like it please give me a like and subscribe to the channel so we can keep growing for sure and well thank you so much I'll see you in the next video and never forget positive mind and a smile always